This is my new chair. It's a uh, Invicare TDX SP. It's pretty cool. It's uh, fully loaded out, except for tilt and recline and the standing and uh, seat elevator. So it just tilts only. But uh, I've been in it about two weeks now and um, operated with my head array up here by my head. It has a on and off switch on the left here up in the head. And then this like different modes and stuff. I hit with my right head, but I'll show you how I work this thing. But when I turn it on, I hit this switch right here. And if you come over here and look at my display, I'll show you what it says. I hit it once, comes on, says that. But when I select a certain mode, I hit this one, goes to that, shows that display. D1 is for drive one, D2 is drive two, D3 is drive three. And if I want to go from different drives, I hit this egg again, it goes to reverse. And if I want to go to a different gear, hit it again. If I want to go to drive two, I'll lean to the left, puts it in a different gear. So I want to go back to drive one, puts it back in where you're changing gears. If I want to tilt my chair, I hit this egg again, it goes into tilt mode. If I want to tilt, hit this to go back. I can go back pretty far as far as I want, basically. Keep going a little bit. And then if I want to sit down, I'll lean to the left, and it goes back down. And see that little thing in the bottom right corner, that exclamation point with the triangle around it? That means I'm tilted too far back to drive for safety reasons. So I have to tilt down a little bit more, and it goes away. And then if I want to drive, hit this egg again. Hit it one more time. Does it drive one? Forward. I'm going back a little bit on my headrest, which has proximity switches in it. The proximity switch is whenever you get close enough to it, it'll activate. And you actually don't have to touch it, it'll just sense your motion and kick in gear. So if I want to go forward, lean my head back a little bit, and then drive. And if I want to turn, I lean my head a little bit to the left, and then turn, turn left. I want to turn right, just turn right, and then if I want to reverse, hit this egg, goes in reverse, and I lean my head back again, and reverse, same thing on turning, I want to turn left, you hold your head to the right, since the turns in the middle, I want to turn left, hold your head to the left, I want to back up again, just go back, and then that's about all that's to it except for, um, let's see here, it also has a built-in thing where I can work my TV through it and stuff, but it's not hooked up yet, so when I get hooked up, I'll have to make a new video, show you how I do it, right for now, I'm going to put it back in my tilt mode, tilt back, relax, Probably put a Blu-ray in, and right now I'm going to power it off. That's all it's to it.